Rising hospitalizations in Missouri grabbing attention tonight. This is now the 10th straight day Missouri has set a record high. Right now, Missouri is in the red zone for new coronavirus cases, and there is no statewide mask mandate. You know, you always think that's going to happen to somebody else, and all of a sudden happens to you, and then you're in that situation, you have to deal with it, and life goes on. State officials say 56 residents of Missouri veterans' homes have died of COVID-19 since September 1st. Governor Parson visited the veterans' home. Parson tested positive for coronavirus on September 23rd. For Missouri Governor Mike Parson and his wife, Teresa, tested positive for COVID-19. Their cases come as the state sees a spike in positive COVID cases. Parson has refused to issue a statewide order, holding many events like campaigning in Springfield Saturday with other state officials without wearing a mask. We need every American and everybody in Missouri to be wearing a mask and socially distancing. Unlike many events across the nation, Bike Fest Lake of the Ozarks was never canceled. Giving roughly 100,000 people the green light to ride on through. Missouri has topped 100,000 COVID-19 cases since the pandemic started. The White House's COVID-19 task force put Missouri in a red zone due to an increase in cases. But in day, somebody's got to take those guidelines. We do, as Missourians, I've got to say, are we willing to do that? And if they do get COVID-19, which they will, and they will when they go to school, they're going to go home and they're going to get over it. You don't need government to tell you to wear a dang mask. First Missouri announcing a new record high for COVID-19 cases. Now the previous record high in a 24 hour period was three days ago. Missouri will be fully open for business in the entire state of Missouri. People crowded in pool decks, disregarding social distancing guidelines. And you know what? There isn't a face mask in sight. If you're worried about um, getting sick, it's, it's pretty much to each their own. After weeks of criticism, Missouri's governor announces a statewide stay at home order. Until now, Missouri was one of just 10 states without a stay at home order. Balls in your court, Missouri Governor Mike Parson. The doctors in your state are basically begging you for their lives. You know, you always think that's going to happen to somebody else and all of a sudden happens to you and then you're in that situation, you have to deal with it and life goes on.